Welcome back. My next guest is a master illusionist whose mixture of magic and music has earned him the nickname, the rock star of magic. Yeah. He is a recipient of the Merlin Award and his show, The Icons of Magic, opens October the 29th at the Legends Theater in Orlando, where Mickey lives. You remember Mickey. Would you please welcome the amazing David Ferrari. <laughs> nice to have you, David. Thank you. It is an honor to be here. Thank you, Governor. And you have asked that I come out and hang out, I guess, so I can learn all your tricks, right? We have some fun things tonight we're gonna do. So let's mm. get started. Uh, ladies and gentlemen, we're gonna take this uh, everyday newspaper and do something extra special tonight, Governor. So okay. we're gonna take this paper here and um, do some amazing feats of magic, all right? all right? So let's take this paper here and uh, I want you to hang on to this glass of orange juice. And uh, obviously, it is real. <laughs> it is. And uh, very carefully, we're going to place the orange juice, ladies and gentlemen, inside the newspaper. That's right. You see, when you believe in magic, you can make miracles take place. Let me show you, Governor. Okay. You see, we know if you put liquid in a newspaper, it's going to leak, but not in the world of magic. That's real orange juice, by the way. Hmm. As you can see, the uh, newspaper is completely dry. And all we have to do really carefully is fold the newspaper up. Again, please hold the glass straight. No. You're doing awesome. No Look way. at this. That no way. is magic. <laughs> wow. Mop in aisle seven. We'll get it later. See, that's why I always come prepared there, you see? That's now all you right. see it, now you don't. <laughs> That's pretty clever. Thank you so much. And talking about uh, orange juice, I have two jumbo oranges here, like you to please all hang right. on to. I will. Now, please do me a favor, Governor. Okay. Take your time. You have two different oranges. Yeah. Please choose one for me. I choose this one. Are you sure? Absolutely. You can sure. change your mind if you like. No. Okay. No, please take one. that one right there. Okay. Excellent. I like this one. In case it gets a little messy, we're prepared. And we're gonna place that back inside the right. table. Fantastic. Now, do me a favor. I okay. want you to examine the uh, orange. Very nice. It's very real. I have in my pocket here a Sharpie. Okay. And we're gonna place that into your pocket here just for a second. All right. Now, Governor, I need to borrow the biggest bill that you have. Ooh. I promise it won't disappear. <laughs> Fantastic. David, all I've got's a buck. There you go. Ooh. That's all I got. <laughs> I love it. Hey, listen, under this new economy, I'm, I'm struggling to get one of those, man. I tell you, this is hard. <laughs> I love it. I love it. This is going to do perfectly. So here's what we're going to do. We're going to take the dollar bill. I'm going to have you hang on to it. Okay. Please, nice and big so the audience can see, place the Sharpie. Just uh, draw your first and last initial. On the uh, bill? On the bill, on the face. Oh, okay. Nice and big so the audience can see, all right? Be like the Treasury Secretary. I get That's to sign right. the dollar bill. That way we know it's the same bill. Yep. Now, we're going to cap the Sharpie. Okay. Excellent. Now, Governor, please fold that in eights for me, okay? Okay, one. Excellent. Two. Very good. Three. Four. Well, that would be... That's, that's perfect. Okay. That's perfect. That's... That's Arkansas math. We get down to the eights there. It's pretty. <laughs> it's really an illusion. I love it. <laughs> Here we go, ladies and gentlemen. We're going to place the bill that governor signed very carefully. Don't blink. It goes inside my hands. Okay. Just by thinking about it, it has vanished from the right hand and the left hand. But this is very odd. You'll see that. It's no. been in full view yeah. the entire time. As have your hands. Yes. I want you to do me a favor. Take your thumb and just plunge it into the orange for me. Into the orange. Yes. We'll do it right here. I know in case it gets a little messy. Very good, Governor. You're doing fantastic. I now, stuck in my thumb and pulled out an orange. And <laughs> said, what a good boy am I. <laughs> I love it. <laughs> so we're going to take it very carefully, Governor. Excellent. Ladies and gentlemen, witness the impossible. 
right before your eyes. We reach inside no. for the first time. Way. And I'm not kidding because all the way inside the orange is a bill. But if we unfold that bill, <laughs> Governor, and to the amazement of the audience, let's show them what we Forget have Forget the audience is to the amazement of me. <laughs> there it is, right? The same there. bill <laughs> with Governor's signature. Now, wow. we're going to do something even more spectacular. I can't now, imagine. I, I love that illusion, and you did an amazing I job. Too. I have a jumbo card trick here we're going to okay. do. And we're going to take these cards, all and right. let's show the beautiful audience here. The cards are all different. They are quite large, so I'm going to show you very carefully. They are all different, OK? So everybody could see that. Now, we're going to take these cards, and Governor, think of yeah. a number between 1 and 20. Free choice. Okay. You Got have it. the number? I do. OK, fantastic. For the first time, tell the audience the number you were thinking of. 13. 13? Yep. Excellent number. My wife's basketball number. I love it. We're going to count 13 cards face down. That's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, 10, 11, 12, and 13. We're going to get rid of the rest of the cards. Okay. The 13 cards, we're going to make two alternating piles. Okay, so I want to have All you right. put your hands up like this. Okay. Fantastic. Keep them nice and steady. Mm -hmm. You're doing beautiful, Governor. Good thing I'm not nervous. <laughs> Take your time. There you go. We're going to balance act here of the cards. You're doing great. We're not going to drop them. Don't worry. There you go. Beautiful. See, it's an illusion in its own here. Mm -hmm. Now, as we make these two alternating piles, Again, Governor could have thought of any one number that he chose. I could have. That's right. So I'm going to have you hang on to this pile. All right. I'm going to come over here. For the first time, ladies and gentlemen, I have this big frame that has been in the full view during the entire illusion. Before we turn the card over, I'm going to show you something very interesting. This card in my hand happens to be the Jack of Diamonds. I'll tell you what. Again, because you chose 13, look at this, ladies and gentlemen. Behind the frame is the matching card. Look at this, the Jack of Diamonds. And also, here's the best part. We place this card face down. Let's turn your card over on top here. The Governor. top one. Yes, the top one. Pull it up? Yes, please. Okay. Show the audience. Nine of clubs. The nine of clubs. Remember the Jack of Diamonds. The frame is completely empty, no mirrors. The world of magic, everything is possible. Thank you, David Ferrari. You can find everything else you need to know at iconsofmagic.com. Do not miss it.